Hello everyone. Welcome to JH Soft Tech. Let us discuss about SAP SD interview question and answers. What is SAP SD? Answer. SAP SD stands for Sales and Distribution. It is one of the core modules of SAP ERP and manages all activity related to sales and distribution process. What are the key components of SAP SD? Answer. The key components of SAP SD include sales order processing, pricing and billing, delivery processing, credit management, transportation management, customer master data, material master data. What is a sales order in SAP SD? Answer. A sales order is a document used to record a customer's request to purchase goods or services. It contains information such as the product, quantity, delivery date and payment terms. Explain the order to cash process in SAP SD. Answer. The order to cash process in SAP SD involves the following steps. Creating a seller order, checking product availability, creating a delivery document, picking and packing goods, creating an invoice, posting the invoice, receipt of payment. What is a delivery document in SAP SD? Answer. A deliver document is created in SAP SD to confirm the deliver of goods to a customer. It contains information such as the shifting date, transportation, details and the quantity of goods begin delivered. What is pricing in SAP SD? Answer. Pricing in SAP SD refers to the determination of the selling price for products or service. It involves factors such as customer specific pricing, discounts, serve charges and tax. Explain the concept of availability check in SAP SD. Answer. Availability check in SAP SD is the process of verifying whether the request quantity of a product is available in stock or can be proceed within a specified time frame. It ensures that promised delivered dates to customer are realistic. What is credit management in SAP SD? Answer. Credit management in SAP SD involves evaluating the credit worthiness of customers before allowing them to place orders on credit. It helps in minimizing the risk of bad debits by setting credit limits and monitoring customer payment behavior. How do you Handle returns in SAP SD. Answer. Returns in SAP SD are handled through the return order process. A customer can indicate a return by creating a return order, which triggers the resolve of relevant documents such as the delivered document and invoice. Can you explain intercompany sales in SAP SD? Answer Intercompany sales in SAP SD refers to the sale of goods or service between different legal entities within the same company. It involves creating sales order deliveries and involves between intercompany partners while ensuring proper accounting and Reconsolation. What is a material determination in SAP SD? Answer Material determination in SAP SD 
is a functionality used to automatically substitute one material with another during the sales order process based on predefined rules it helps in offering alternates to customers when the request material is unavailable explain the concept of output determination in sap sd answer output determination in sap sd is the process of determining which forms documents or messages need to be sent to customers or partners at different stages of the sales process it involves defining output types condition records and assigning them to relevant business transactions what is a sales organization in sap sd answer in sap sd a sales organization represents an organizational unit responsible for the sales of products or service it is assigned to a company code and it used for defining sales related structures and process what are sales document types in sap sd answer sales document types in sap sd define the different types of sales documents such as sales orders inquiries quotations and contracts each document types has specific attributes and processing rules how do you configure shifting point determination in sap sd answer shifting point determination in sap sd is configured using the combination of shifting conditions loading groups and shifting point determination rules these rules helps in determining the shifting point based on various factors such as the shifting condition shifting plant and loading group what is a customer material info record in sap sd answer a customer material info record in sap sd is used to store specific information about a material for a particular customer it includes details such as alternative materials customer specific pricing and delivery preference explain the difference between a sales order and a delivered order in sap sd answer a sales order in sap sd is a document that records a customer's request to purchase goods or service whereas a delivery order is a document that confirms the deliver of goods to the customer sales order precedes the delivery order in the order to cash process how do you handle free goods in sap sd answer free goods in sap sd are handled through the use of condition techniques such as free goods determination this involves defining condition types condition records and pricing producers to automatically include free goods when certain condition are met in a sales order what is consignment sales in sap sd answer consignment sales in sap sd is a process where goods are delivered to a customer but ownership of the goods remains while the selling company until they are customized or sold by the customer it involves creating consignment full up orders and consignment issue orders explain how rebate processing work in sap sd answer rebate processing in sap sd involves providing customers with discounts or rebates based on predefined agreements or sales volumes it includes configuring 
rebate agreements, tracking, eligible sales volumes and processing rebate claims. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.